So nice to exalt the Lord. And we have a real nice service plan. We have a real nice sermon. You wouldn't hear me say anything different than that, would you? Nope. Nope. It's a, it's a nice one. We're, it's Christmas time. We've got some Christmas songs. And I'm just excited to be here to exalt the Lord together with you and worship and, and word. So we're going to start. Are we ready here? We're going to start with a song everybody knows. And we just pray that you would stand together with us right now and sing along. As we sing, God rest ye merry gentlemen. Here we go. Two, three, Be 
able to come and worship you, Lord. You have been so good to us. And we have so much to celebrate this Christmas season, Lord, that you came and was born to live a perfect life and die for us and bought us, Lord. We thank you for everything that you've done and what you're doing and what you're going to do, Lord. We have so much to think about and so much to be thankful for. And so once again, Lord, we thank you and we ask for all these blessings in your precious name we pray, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise God. You may be seated, everyone. All right. Okay. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> One more Sunday after today, and then it's Christmas time. And we've got an awesome surprise youth special nativity drama music done by the youth this next Sunday. And so I want to remind all our youth and everybody that we're having a run-through practice after church today and a dress rehearsal on Saturday, and practicing Wednesday, and a dress rehearsal on Saturday So at 11 o'clock. So it's real important that we get there and we can run through with the costumes and everything on. It's going to be just a wonderful service in the other room in the fellowship hall. And it sounds like they have a wonderful breakfast continental style going on. And it's just going to be special. And it's going to be different. It's going to be really nice. But also, I want to uh, remind that uh, Thursday is our Your Ministries Food for Lynn County Outreach. So this Thursday, what? Oh, we're postponing. Okay. Information. Useful to me. Never mind. Forget about the Thursday Your Kid Food for Lynn County thing. We're going to postpone it to the next time, I guess. Okay, so much going on. That makes sense to me, doesn't it? What about yeah. to you? Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Cool. All right. Well, it is one thing I know for sure is we are having our men's breakfast this Saturday, right? Yes, so this Saturday men's breakfast is going to be good, and we'll have fellowship, and it'll be fun, and uh, we we'll just talk about everything, and we pray for each other, and it's encouraging, and it's a... Is a good way to <clears throat> end the week anyway, huh? So I hope to see you. Anybody that considers themselves a man to come on down and join us for breakfast Saturday at 9 o'clock. Yeah, it's not too early, but uh, it's really pretty cool. It's breakfast, that's right. Also, I've, uh, Dom made known to me that we have a need for a new coffee maker. Apparently our 40 cup coffee maker has bit the dust and it leaks and runs over. And so we'd like to have a 40 cup coffee maker by Christmas or at least maybe by Wednesday. by Wednesday. So by this Wednesday. So if you're interested in helping or donating towards that or, 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 Buying or getting one. that, let us know so that we don't end up getting too many of them or whatever. But uh, we, we could, we'd really appreciate anybody's help to get our coffee maker up and running. So who likes to drink coffee here? Just me and Bill. <laughs> Ezra. And Bill. So it's really important. <laughs> Thanks, 40 cup maker. <laughs> yeah. That's right. So anyways, those are our current needs right now as far as stuff goes. And uh, just thank you everybody that does so much in helping clean this church and work on the yard. And you notice our cross up there has gotten kind of more finished. Or is it finished? Yeah, you know, he buttoned it up and made it look a little more uniform. Did anybody notice that? I thought it looked right before. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's really a cool wooden cross. It's really pretty cool that we, we have one. So, but anyways, I think, am I forgetting anything else? I don't think so. We can just continue putting all our heart and our thoughts and our focus on the Lord Jesus this morning and uh, as we worship him with everything that we do and a reading of scripture. Thank you. Matthew chapter 1 verses 21 through 25. And she shall bring forth a son and thou shalt call his name Jesus, for he shall save his people from their sins. Now all this was done, 
that it might be fulfilled which was spoken of the Lord by the prophet, saying, Behold, a virgin shall be with child, and shall bring forth a son, and they shall call his name Emmanuel, which being interpreted is God with us. Then Joseph, being raised from sleep, did as the angel of the Lord had bidden him, and took unto him his wife. And he knew her not till she had brought forth her firstborn son, and he called his name Jesus. Matthew chapter 1, verses 21 through 25. Praise the Lord. That is good. The Christmas story. We're going to be embellishing on that a little bit today and the wise men and some things about the birth of Jesus today. I'm excited about it. Um, right now we're going to go ahead and sing the angels we have heard on high. So sing along with us. You might want to stand for this. Here we go. <coughs>
from those three kings. Lord, we love you and we thank you for the message that you have for us from the birth of you, Lord. And we just thank you for this opportunity to share it. And we just thank you for everything you do. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Right now, we have our time of prayer, and so we're going to pray together. Could we bow our heads together in prayer? Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you, Lord, for this opportunity to come together as one and pray. We are so blessed, Lord, to have uh, disciples and people that want to exalt you and, and know and understand the power that comes from prayer when we pray all together. And that's so important that we meet together, Lord, and you know, it's so important that, that we come together to exalt you and pray together and have fellowship. It's, it's something that you love, Lord, and you love it when your church is together. And so we thank you for this opportunity to pray as one as we exalt you and look to you for all of our answers. Once again, Lord, we want to hold up Nate, who has been struggling with his cancer, and uh, it just seems to be progressive a little more all the time and it seems like through these trials though he does go and visit different people he has a different awareness of life it seems like lord because he knows his time is short here and sometimes when i think about how he thinks about how life is short how you want all of us to be really realizing and understanding that life is short here and it's so important that we get focused on you and we understand the things that you want us to understand because we never know when we're when our time comes up. And so, Lord, I just pray that you continue to bless Nate. I know that he's afflicted, but, Lord, I just pray that you can increase his faith, even though sometimes it seems like his physical being is just lessened all the time. So, Lord, just bless him, encourage him, encourage that whole family, and just continue to work in their life in a big way. Lord, also we've had a request for Ashley's dad who is struggling and kind of stressed because uh, her aunt died and uh, he is having to move now, Lord, and he's having a hard time finding, I think, a place to go and, and help to move everything. And so, Lord, I pray that you would continue to bless him. And I know he believes a little, Lord, and so I just pray that you would increase his faith and encourage him to, to know how important it is to to seek you for the answers lord and it's so important for all of us to seek you for our answers because sometimes when we figure out things on our own lord they're wrong we need to come to you first and we get misled so easily lord like lost sheep led astray so lord i pray that you would just bless each and every person bless her dad too and just help us all here lord and for everybody who has a special prayer request I thank you, Lord, also for helping Pat to have a good report on her doctor's appointment and, and that Denda is for having her eye uh, looked at and operated on or whatever it might have to be done by the specialist that she is okay physically to be able to have that done. And so I just thank you for them. And I thank you for the praise reports that we have. Norse, I, I ask you, Lord, to continue to bless the children for the children's skits and the, and the play that's coming up next week and stuff. And the, the whole service we play, pray that you would bless it in a big way, the music and everything. It's going to be a different thing for everybody. And, oh, Lord, we just pray that you would just bless it and anoint the whole thing. And we just thank you. We thank you for all the people that are praying and the disciples here and everyone who has a special need, Lord. I pray that you would just bless them at their need. And I just thank you for having them here today. Lord, I just thank you for everything. We ask for all of these things, Lord, in your precious name we pray. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise God. Thank you for praying with me today. Uh, can we have our ushers come forward today? But it's our time for giving right now, and I pray that you would give with a whole heart. We're going to sing a song right now called Oh Holy Night. I pray you sing along with us here also. <laughs>
Jesus was born for us. Hallelujah. Well, right now it's time to stand up and greet somebody and make them welcome. And we'll be switching over for the sermon. And children are excused at Children's Church. And make somebody welcome. Greet somebody. We'll be started in a moment. <laughs> Welcome, 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 welcome. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. 